to me that we have planned protests by Nigeria Labour Congress and Trade Union Congress in Nigeria, scheduled to commence uh, on Wednesday, 2nd of August 2023. And the IGP has said it clearly that there is no room for any violent protest in Nigeria. He has ordered for water test security across the country while appealing for camp from all angles in Nigeria. The acting inspector of this Federal Republic of Nigeria, IGP Kayode, that he will be able to complete the FDM, is deeply concerned about recent development regarding planned nationwide protests by the Nigerian Labour Congress and Trade Union Congress. Why be mindful of the right to peaceful protest? As is trained in our constitution, the IGP urges all parties involved to ensure that the planned demonstrations are conducted in a peaceful manner to prevent being attacked by miscreants. Owing to the previous ugly experiences of such protests in most major cosmopolitan cities in the country, the IGP, however, acknowledges the differences raised by the labor unions and the importance of constructive dialogue, which is seen quite well in addressing these issues. In light of this, the Inspector General of Police orders the Commissioners of Police in charge of various commands and Supervisory Assistant Inspectors General of Police to engage in fruitful discussions with the Nigerian Labour Congress and Trade Union Congress leadership to foster understanding and reach common grounds on the planned protest. A peaceful and coordinated of the planned protest has all necessary measures to facilitate the peaceful conduct of these demonstrations have been in place. However, it is here very affirmed that any attempt by miscreants to exploit the situation of violent purposes, this of a vandalism, Gastalism and extortion be met with firm, professional, and commensurate lawful approach. The police will not tolerate any act that threatens the peace and well being of our country. In light of the potential challenges posed by the planned protests, the Nigerian Police Force is fully prepared to deploy all available resources to maintain law and order and to protect the lives and property of our citizens. The LGP therefore calls on all of us to be vigilant, professional, and uphold the highest standards of conduct during this period. The police boss urges all stakeholders, including the Nigerian Labour Congress, Trade Union Congress, and other civil society groups to embrace this without as the most effective means of resolving differences, while also emphasizing that the police is committed to ensuring a secure and conducive environment for open dialogue, constructive engagement, and mutual understanding for a seamless exercise of civil rights. Thank you.